Hello everyone, welcome back again to OnHow channel. My name is Anas and I'm working for you. So if you have any questions or any video requests, make sure to drop on below in a comment or check out my Instagram right here below me. I don't reply to each comment. If you are wondering again why is that, because simply I'm working for you. And in this video, I will show you how to add gradient color to your Shopify section on your store. And I mean only a section, not the whole Shopify store and not the whole page. Adding a color gradient to the whole Shopify store is really easy. Uh, if you are interested in how to do that, just drop me a comment, I will be happy to help you out. But for adding a specific gradient color, and I mean any gradient, you can customize it however you want, there is no option to add it on only a section. Actually, you can even change the color for a section on your Shopify store. There is some section that will give you the option to change the background color for, for example, the header or the footer actually they will give you the option to uh, change the background color. However, for other sections on your Shop Shopify store, you cannot actually change the background color. And I did make that video as well on how to change the color for any section on your Shopify store. And I mean only that particular se section to set a different color for it. And as well as adding a picture to the only a section on your Shopify store. Let me show you that in a moment. By the way, this is the Shopify store that I do tutorials on and all the things that you see here I did show them in videos including this banner right here the order tracking page without any apps or anything like that and even uh, removing the underlines from the menu right here you know if, I, if you hover with the mouse over a menu it will show an underline below it and there is no videos on YouTube on how to remove them and one of my subscribers, he did request me in a comment on how we can change the underlines and I did make that video for him. So if you have any questions or any video requests, just drop me a comment. I will be happy to help you out. So let's just scroll down and show you the example as I said. Here we go. So this is a multi column section right here. And as you can see, I did set a color background. I mean picture, sorry. I did set a background picture for it as you can see. This is a picture actually. And the section below it, which is the contact us form and I did change the color for it as you can see and only the section not the whole Shopify store so what if you want to add a gradient color not a plain color like this one which is blue what if you want a gradient color and as I said it's really easy to add it to the whole page or the whole Shopify store however if you want to add it to only a section there is no option to do that and you cannot find any video I challenge you if you do find any video, I will delete my video. <laughs> you will not find any video on how to do so. However, you are watching on how channel and I will show you how to do that. And let me show you that right now. So without any more talking, let's just get to it. But before we start, please, if this video helped you out, help me out pressing the like button. I would really appreciate it. It's completely free and it will motivate me to make more videos for you guys. So I would really appreciate it. So let's just close this and get back to Shopify Team Customizer because that's what we're going to use. So click on online store from here, then click on customize option right here. Then it will show you the team customizer, obviously. So right now, let's just add a section in here and we will add a gradient color for. And I will do that in demonstration. I will actually make a gradient by any color that I do personally like, then I will set it for the section. So let's just scroll down a little bit and let's just add another section in here between, uh, between the product reviews carousel and the contact desk form. So let's just click on add section and let's just add for example the multi column one so let's just add this one and here we go as you can see this is the multi column section so if i click on it right here on the multi column options in here there is no option to set the background picture or a background color as you can see uh, there is only the heading the picture width which is the based on the the column right here not the background and also the image ratio if you want to add uh, a picture in here not the text uh, as the example is showing us right here and the background in here which is the background for the column there is no option to set the color in here however i will show you how to do that so what we need to do in order to set a gradient color to this section we need to add a custom code to the to this section and not the custom code the liquid code based on the ruby reds no just css code yeah because every option every section sorry every section on the shopify store have the custom css option right here as you can see the last option if i click on it it will show me an option in here uh, to paste in a css code as you can see so we will need to add a, a css code then i will show you a second trick in order to set a gradient color for so the first thing you're going to do is scroll down the description box and you will see a link named as code simply click on it and it will take you to this page right here where you're gonna see a really short code as you can see 
So simply copy this code is five lines as you can see five lines of code simply right click and copy and get back in here and paste it in the custom CSS. And by the way, let me show you that this option is actually available on any section. So let's just scroll down this video. For example, the video right here, if you scroll down and there is custom CSS. So it's available on any section on your Shopify store, uh, multimedia college right here. Here is custom CSS option. So, so there is no restrictions on which section you can do this trick and which you cannot. You can do it on any section. So let's just get back to the multi column in here and let's just uh, paste it in the custom CSS section. So let's just paste it in here and here we go. As you can see, it did set it as background picture. And yes, you might notice I said background gradient, not the background picture, right? And just give me a moment. I will show you how to add the gradient based on this code. So the second thing you're going to do is scroll down again to the description box and you will see a link name it as gradient. Simply click on it then it will take you to this page right here. So this is actually a tool that will let you create any gradient you want based on any color you want. For example if we click on show all gradients on here on the top left corner simply click on it and it will show you a lot of gradients as you can see. And this is all based on one color, I think, which is white or red. So if I click on red color right here, as you can see, it will show me all the gradients that are based on the red color. As you can see, there is a lot and there is more colors in here. Uh, orange, yellow, green and the best I do find that, or actually my personal favorite because uh, this is a subjective in each one like different design or color, obviously. So let's just go for my favorite in here. What is it? And there is some colors that are based on brands. As you can see, Facebook Messenger, this one. Here it is. I do like this one called Ali, as you can see. And I think it's based on Ali Express colors or what is it? I'm not sure. So simply let's just click on it. And here it is. This is the color or this is the gradient that I want to add to that particular section. The next thing you're going to do is click on this icon right here at the top right corner. It says uh, it's a download icon. So so simply click on it and it will download the picture and let's just check out the picture oops it did open up in my other monitor let's just drag it here here we go so this is the gradient that i want to add to my shopify section so the next thing you're going to do is get back to the shopify dashboard then access the content uh, option right here then click on files and upload the picture obviously so let's just upload the picture in here and here we go and the file uploaded successfully as you can see so the next thing you're going to do is copy the link for it simply uh, click on the icon right here for the picture uh, and that will copy the link so let's just click on it and the link was copied and let's just get back to the section and exactly to the custom css option where we did best in the call and the last step in here which is changing the url for the picture so let's just select the url and make sure you do select the URL and between the quotation mark. If you did remove the quotation mark by accident, it will not work. So make sure to keep the quotation mark in between the URL and simply remove the old URL and paste in the new URL for the, which is the gradient. And here we go. As you can see, this is the gradient that I did go for. And here it is on my section, as you can see. So the last thing you're going to do is simply click on save and let's just check out our Shopify store and to see how it look like and let's just scroll down and here it is as you can see it looks really good and it's far better than the setting a uh, plain color like this one which is blue and that's how you add a gradient color to any section on your shopify store and as i said in the beginning of the video i'm working for you so if you have any questions or any video requests make sure to drop them below in the comment or check out my instagram right here below me i do reply to each comment as well as messages on my instagram if you are wondering again why is that because simply i'm working for you but for now, I think my job is done. So thanks for watching. Catch you in the next one.